Hello everyone, welcome to GK Today. China's space program has been growing by leaps and bounds with 2021 as one of the most successful year for Beijing in the 21st century. The country has now built an artificial moon facility that will stimulate lunar conditions and the environment for scientists to test new tech and future missions. Being called the first of its kind in the world, the facility located in the eastern Xiangyu province which will make gravity disappear. The facility can replicate low gravity environment for as long as one wants, making China less dependent on zero gravity planes to train astronauts and environment to test new rovers and technologies. The mini moon is about two feet in diameter and the artificial surface has been made with rocks, dust that are as light as those on the moon. It is worth mentioning that Gravity on the moon is not zero. It is once as powerful as the gravity on earth due to the magnetic field. The idea to develop this facility has its root in the Russian born physician Andrei James experiment to levitate a frog with a magnet. The physicist later won a Nobel for this groundbreaking experiment. Magnetic levitation is certainly not the same as anti-gravity. But there is a variety of situations where mimicking microgravity by magnetic field could be invaluable to expect the unexpected in space research. With China already clearing the fourth phase of its lunar exploration program that will see the construction of the research station on the moon and lunar exploration through future, Chang'e 6, Chang'e 7 and Chang'e 8 mission, the new facility will play a crucial part. The Chang'e 7 spacecraft will be launched at the moon's south pole, following by Chang'e 6, which will return the samples from the surface. Beijing already has plans to land astronauts on the lunar surface by 2030, as it's continued the construction of its space station in low Earth orbit. It is noted that China has already developed an artificial sun to replicate the nuclear fusion process that occurs naturally in the sun and stars to provide almost infinite clean energy. So that's all for the update. Thanks for watching.